Councilman Medina. Yes, thank you, Council President. Good evening, everyone. I do have some reports here that I uh, absorbed from Council Councilwoman Hickey. Uh, I'm gonna leave uh, prematurely, so uh, just be patient with me. Uh, a couple of reports here from the City Clerk's Office. It's actually November 8th, last month. Um, the following license and permits and transcripts issued by the City Clerk's Office during the month of October 2018 and fees received have been turned over to the Municipal, municipal Treasurer of the City of Linden. 105 birth, death, and marriage transcripts, 25 marriage civil unions uh, licenses, four miscellaneous revenue, 161 EDRS vital statistics, total transaction 295, total revenue for, for the city $4,306.73 and state revenue $625. Again, this one, this report is for November 2018. I'm not going to read the verbiage. But 53 uh, births, death, and marriage transcripts, 26 marriage civil union licenses, two miscellaneous revenue, one bingo slash raffle, 202 EDRS vital statistics, total transaction 284, total revenue to the city $3,925.13, total revenue to the state $650. Uh, also, the City Clerk Licensing Division is, submitted, is submitting this monthly report for the month of October 2018. This office issued 13 dog licenses and 82 miscellaneous licenses and collected $4,147. And for the month of November 2018, they issued 14 dog licenses and seven miscellaneous licenses and collected $280. That completes that, thank you. Really short for the ninth ward. Again, my Councilman uh, Roman and Councilwoman um, Democrat has mentioned a lot of the road paving and uh, sidewalk and curb jobs have been put on hold due to the wet, rainy uh, weather and the cold weather. So again, I ask folks for the ninth ward. We will we will get back to you. We will complete those jobs, and also they are out there just cleaning up some of the mess that the contractor made when they uh, went and to uh, dig out the old sidewalks, cut those roots and whatnot. So they're, they're out there, they were out there last week on Friday. I believe they're out there again sometime this week uh, to put topsoil, do some of the restorations on some of those properties. But again, and we haven't gotten to you this year, I assure you we're, we will get to you um, hopefully early spring or, or mid spring of um, 2019. Um, that said, uh, just real quick, I'm sorry, I don't wanna miss anything. Um, the 9th and 10th Ward, we are going to, myself and Councilwoman Hickey will be going out there soon to look at some of these homes for the Christmas light contest. If you want us to come uh, to your home and look at it, just shoot us an email, shoot us a text, give us a call, um, provide your address and we will make sure that we get to your home um, and uh, submit your address for consideration. Also the last couple, actually the last few weeks it's just been a little bit nuts here in Linden with crime and, and things that's been happening. So a big thank you to our first responders, especially our police department. As you, most of you guys all know, on Sunday there was a carjacking attempt. It was, wasn't an attempt, it was a carjacking at ShopRite. And uh, our police department did a great job at, at taking care of that issue. But it seems like around the holidays, a lot of things are highlighted um, uh, throughout the country. And especially in Linden, we do get a lot of traffic due to that one and nine corridor for, for a lot of folks that travel into Linden to just don't want to do any good. So I tell folks, you know, when you read this negative press, 85%, I'm just putting a number here, but 85%, in my opinion, are uh, outsiders coming into Linden committing crime, robbery and whatnot. Um, I think we got a great town. We got a, gr a lot of great people. Uh, we're, we're, not, we're, we're not innocent here. There's going to be crime even from local uh, residents and whatnot, but the majority of our crime are from outsiders, and our police department do an amazing job, amazing job tackling these issues. And I think they, uh, they're putting out a really strong message out there to anyone who's thinking of coming into Linden and committing a crime here in Linden. So with that being said, uh, I just want to wish everyone a happy holiday, safe holiday. And for the last time, Council President, that concludes my report. Thank you. Thank you, Councilman.